Welcome to RayaGurukul.com. This video will discuss about how to add custom field in Rally or how to customize or fail in Rally. So, if you are new to this channel, consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates. Let's begin with today's agenda. Then we'll move further with practical demo. So, in this video, we'll cover it up about what is custom field, how to add new custom field how to configure or customize custom field with practical demo so let's jump to jira login credential where post login we are able to see this dashboard page from here you can select setup tab and you will jump to administrator customization page for customizing custom fields Definitely we will need administrator login credential or product owner or the scrum master login credentials. Without that, we cannot do it. So let's understand what is custom fields. So whenever we are talking about any specific project and we are selecting any fields which is already present. So if you can see here inside the defects, these all fields are already present. But Whenever we can see these fields like blocked, blocked reasons, expenditure, fixed in bill, ID, these fields were definitely created by administrator itself. If we want to create it, we just have to click on new field. Let me show you from where I jumped here and select workspace and project. Go to workspace and select your project. From the project sections, you can also do that. Either you can do it for the workspace as well. So here you can see the fields. So this is a custom fields which is already created. But if you want to create our own fields, that is also possible. These fields are already created by Riley itself and we can customize it or create it. There are two options. Uh, you Either you can export it from the workspace so simply click on the export workspace custom field you can see it in excel file which is already there but if we want to create it our own field for the defects definitely we can create it we just have to add new custom fields that is defect new i am giving the name here display name you can keep the same name or you can also keep the different name as well there are different options from which option you are looking for if you will select boolean definitely it will accept response in yes or no fields if you want to make it as a date then definitely you can select date decimals integer string or if you want to make it as a drop down list then you have to provide the drop down value. I'm giving here just new open a site. So once you will open this drop down, you will find only these values are populated. If you want to make this as a for this project or you can keep it for every project it will populate if you want to mark it for the child project also then this fields will be available in child project as well so i'm keeping only for this project post adding all this detail click on save and close now you will find it out the fields is available here you can see here this is a customized field we can also mark it as a required field whenever it is needed. So let's, cu let's customize it. And from here, you can find it out whatever detail we have added. You can add it here. So for the required fields, we just need to work on workspace level. So save and close. Go to workspace. And from the box face fields, you will find it out. Insert the defects. 
because that fail I was created for the particular project because of that it won't be available here but we can create it for our own so we can mark it as a required or non required field we can select it at any type of contains so let's jump to the project again and go to fields now you can see this fields are available here but if you want to check it again you can see this field is available here there are different other options are available also available visible and visible on child projects you can see here this is text and from the drop down you can create it for rest other field as well so let's if you want to print it you can also print this field and you can view it the content of custom field same thing we can also do that for the workspace and other projects level so that's all about creating a custom field in rally hope you liked it if you really enjoyed the session consider subscribing and pressing bell icon for more updates thank you for watching